And we're, we're, you know, as we're approaching that 10 day mark, yes, that's when a lot of times meteorologists will throw that forecast on. Sometimes you see them just try to go for the 10 day. Yeah, what it is, we do have a 10 day on the 11 o'clock show. We do have that in Eclipse, it's 10 days away. So, hey, tune in later on this That'll evening. That'll be our first official Russ, The forecast. first numbers you're looking at. Yes, okay. there we go. And I'm feeling good about it right now. Ooh. But uh, again, we uh, got to keep a close eye as we go throughout the next 10 days. This is like the holiday season, like 2.0 around here. A little here, bit, yeah. For Northeast Ohio, beginning with this weekend. Uh, it's like Thanksgiving, right? And then we have the final four. That's a little bit of a Christmas. Then <laughs> the solar eclipse, right? That is, I guess, New Year's. But overall, Get prepared for some raindrops on the way, but not for tonight. Things are quiet and Saturday appears to be the wettest day. Then Easter Sunday appears to be on a drier side for now. But have those umbrellas just on standby as we go throughout time here. Clouds are going to be increasing, partly cloudy to mostly cloudy skies, especially after midnight temperatures. They're going to be holding steady in the mid 30s by the time the rainfall arrives. Here's the overall setup, folks. We have high pressure and dominant control. That's in the driver's seat and that's giving us the clearing skies, not only for us in northeast Ohio, all throughout the Buckeye state and off to the west. Yes, we have a clouds that's going to be rolling in. It doesn't appear to be much happening off to the west, but we have a warm front that's positioned right in northern Missouri, and that is going to be the focal point of more shower development as we head throughout time here. And this first round of rain is going to be riding right along that front and arriving here for tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow morning, clearing out by the afternoon. Here's your Sunday. I just want to zip through a generic look of what to expect for your weekend. Sunday's looking dry before more rain chances roll back in late Sunday into early Monday. Now, here's more detail to the forecast with your National Design Mart hour by hour forecast around 8 and 9 o'clock. This solution is picking up on the temperatures we'll have in place mid 30s. So the onset of this, especially out to the east, could start off as a little bit of rain and snow, but all rain approaching 9 and 10 o'clock. This is going to be the most persistent round of rain we have for your Saturday morning. Then by the afternoon, turning more scattered, still tracking the south wind. So everyone will be approaching the lower 50s. That's good. Then this cold front arriving by 6 and 7 o'clock for tomorrow afternoon and evening. Winds are going to be switching out of the north for your Saturday uh, night right into early Sunday. Clouds are going to be sticking around. This is what to expect for your Sunday morning. Any early morning services is going to be a chilly start, but no rain. Things are looking quiet, partly cloudy skies by the afternoon. Hey, Easter Sunday, we could get on a little bit of glimmers of sun before it sets. Then more rain going to be a part of the forecast to wrap up your Sunday right into early Monday. Now the entirety of your weekend, we could pick up closer to a, a half an inch to three quarters of an inch of rain, but not a complete washout. And unfortunately, we have more rain and precipitation chances to talk about rain that could be mixing in with a little bit of snow as we approach midweek. And as we go throughout time here with your big picture forecast, rain on the way Monday. We'll catch a break Monday evening, then more rain and thunderstorm chances Tuesday. This is going to be a powerhouse of a low pressure system. The wraparound effect of this is going to give us more lake enhancement of rain and snow and falling temperatures on the way with your union home mortgage. 70 outlook. Things are looking milder for Monday and Tuesday, then lower 40s with that rain snow mix. Wind as well for Wednesday and Thursday, then approaching final four for Friday, lower 40s, a chilly forecast. All right, but I see no rain once we hit Friday, so maybe that will be the magic week. At that point, we're three days away. It's the yeah. holiday season. Fingers crossed. Yeah. <laughs> Anthony, thanks. Sure.